Hey guys and welcome back to another video and today just to share with you what I believe to be the smallest Ethernet gigabit switch available in the world. Now I'm not really sure that it's available in the world but in my particular case this was the smallest that I could find and honestly I searched around all the web so probably if not the smallest it is one of the smallest gigabit switches. Now guys a few weeks ago I had a small project and that small project was basically to take a cable Ethernet cable to around my second floor and distribute through all the areas right over there rooms and the office that we have and so on and so forth. So I had a small we still have that small distribution box on the wall and the measure is 21 by 21 centimeters and in terms of depth it is roughly six centimeters so what I wanted was to keep the coaxial cables that we use for the TVs but I also inserted the Ethernet cables in this particular case cat 5e and one of the challenges was to get a switch a gigabit switch in this particular case so that we could take full advantage of our speed uh, and I found this guy right over here after a lot of search if you guys take attention it is almost the size of the power adapter so this is a great addition it also it is well built it's made out of metal so it has a great dissipation and it also has here at the back two holes so that we can uh, put it on the wall with two screws which I did inside that distribution box and then just hangs there and we do all the connections right over here in terms of speeds if you guys are wondering it is a full gigabit switch so I've been using it for quite some time and so far I haven't had any issues at all now my suggestion is if you guys are looking for something really small and you don't need to have such a project like I had which was really useful but let's say that you want to uh, distribute your signal uh, on your living room and you don't want something big then this can be a great helpful for this kind of scenario or just behind your TV or something like that where we can just split the signal and have everything working at a budget cost and at a reasonable I do believe price for the quality that we have and that is it guys hopefully this video was helpful in some way and if it was don't forget that usual thumbs up my name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you guys on the next one